guys. So, today I'm bringing you a monstrous empty. I can tell you on that. I have a whole trash bag full of it. You can see, it is so many empties. I'm just gonna yeah, collect them as they come and by section by section. So, let's just do it. I used a whole bunch of uh, yeah, cotton pads after, as you can see. It is just like, what? So many, I have lost count of them, so that was one empties. <laughs> then I used three dry shampoos. Uh, the one I use the most is the Batiste one, the Brand Lively Floral, it's my favorite. And then I also have one by Colab. The one uh, Ruth Crilly Amal recommends has uh, made. It's a good one, but I prefer the Batiste one. It's cheaper, actually, <laughs> when you have to compare the prices. But yeah, three dry shampoos. I used up some cotton buds, just a normal size pack of them yeah we always use them so yeah that was that then i used up two shampoos i usually buy this one and if i can't get to the the beauty health store matas then i just go to the local supermarket and buy this one I, I, this is not so good for my hair actually but this is is if it's an emergency and then i also used up a um, conditioner which also just is the emergency conditioner for my hair from the local supermarket so yeah that was that forgot to mention this one this is just a kids shampoo i used that for my makeup brushes actually this is very yeah gentle for the uh, bristles and all that so yeah also that was a shampoo and then i used up for toothpaste, we always use toothpaste for our teeth, morning and evening, so yeah, that was also that. Then I used up a heat protection spray, the cap is falling up, it's just somewhere down in the back, but yeah, I used that up. Then I have used two uh, sh shower gels, and uh, this is the, just the olive shower gel by the body shop, uh, the travel size and the regular size. It has a new packaging now with a black cap, actually a much better... Um, packaging I would say so yeah that's your stuff and I've also used a travel size um, olive cream body scrub ups and I, I really love the olive range is really good for dry skin and oh, my skin is just soft for yeah two days and then I just have to reapply the body butter and then it's just mm, two more days so good and I really like this body scrub it is so gentle on the skin when it's a cream one it's not so harsh and all that and then I am throwing out this uh, wild almond body butter by the body shop because it's completely dried in uh, the edges so I can't use that anymore but for the time I used it I really like the scent of it it's I don't know if it's good for dry skin or not but it, I really love the scent of it really loved it then I used up three micellar waters hello this is for dry sensitive skin I am as my skin type is sensitive and uh, then I'm just dehydrated in on the edges and bit of clogginess on the nose but that's just normal but I'm a sensitive girl so yeah three of these I just do some use them up like very fast I need to stock up I need to stock up these are good and I've used two packs of uh, pores, nose pore strips up and these are what is it cajol nose pores uh, yeah pore strips and these are the tea tree and cow and um, pore strips these are so so good they are so good this is by Revitel and this is by formula 10 series 6 this is so good I really love it with Carolyn it's white clay I oh so good for sensitive skin and dry skin so good clay masks and all that we love and these actually quite good they go down and cleanse and then I just go after and check if I have to deep cleanse even more then I've used up some eye, eye makeup remover gel. I, I prefer to use a separate eye makeup remover for my eyes instead of using just the clay mask, not clay mask, my cellar water right on. So yeah, this, this is uh, very good for, for young skin. I still consider the skin around my eyes from fairly, fairly young. So I still use this. I really like this. This is for all skin types. So good. Then I've used up two deodorants. These are just plain scent free and perfume perfume free deodorants so yeah it's good for me I don't want to have perfume allergies and start an itchy start to itch in my pits and all that so yeah just a plain yeah deodorant for me I use up a hand lotion this is by Bounce Pop. this is so that's such a great hand lotion I love it but I love 
the hand lotion I'm using right now even better. It's just so good, but this is really good. This is good hand cream. This is for Nordic skin, and yeah, it's so good, so soft. It makes your hands so soft, really nourishing. Then I've used a whole bunch of skincare up. First of all, this by Mesa's, Mesa's Nature, the cleansing, uh, the wash gel, the skin tonic, the day cream, SPF 15, and the night cream. Just, it's just, yeah, I, I love this because it has organic aloe vera and E vitamin in it, and it's just without perfume, parabens, and colorants, just so good. And yeah, I, I, I'm a big fan of SPF in my day cream, so gotta take care of this skin. We only have this one. Then I've used two serums up by the brand Placia. This is the 3 in 1 serum, so good. It goes down on all three layers of your skin the top skin, the leather skin, and the under skin. It's just mm, so good. I really love it. I use it every day, and it's safe enough to use it around your eyes. So good. Then I used up an eye cream. This is by Matas. This is for dry sensitive skin, and it's good because my eye area is actually quite dry. So it's good. And I would really like it. Just on with it, I've been using eye cream since I was 12, 13 years old. So yeah, you can never start too early. So start before you're in, start in your teens, teenage years, but teenage years with eye cream, then you will have good uh, skin around your eyes and no crow's feet, because we don't like crow's feet. And then I have used up my, just a, yeah, we can say tester, tester size of my favorite skincare brand ever that I tried out when I went to school. This is the brand Exuviance. Love it, love it, let me see. I used up the Gentle Cleansing Cream, the Soothing Toning Lotion, this is a skin tonic, and I've used up, let me see, uh, the Vespera Bionic Serum, love this stuff, and I've used up, um, let me see, let me see, the Purifying Clay Mask, this is, ah, heaven. And the rejuvenating treatment mask. This is a peel-off mask. This is so good. It, is, it has a quite a strong. It has a quite strong scent. So I just avoided down here, so I didn't have that scent of yeah alcohol in my nose. But it's so good. I used up the multi multi protective day cream with SPF 20. So good. Used up the evening restorative complex. So good for the evening. It, it is. It has a green color, and then it's just, you put it on, and you're like, ah, oh, I'm ready for bed. This is so good. And then I have used up the heel and elbow dry skin repair. Oh my god, so good for your feet. They, it, this leaves your feet soft as a baby's butt. So good, so good. Oh, I found someone. Something else. This is the. This is just a tester. This is the Dior Capture Total. It is a yeah, what can you say? It's a multi-protection perfection concentrate. I believe this is kind of a serum. I actually kind of liked it. This was just an emergency because at that at that time I uh, at that time because I had no uh, serum. I couldn't even afford it. So I took this out from all my testers and yeah, it worked great. It has a, it has a little pump, so it was easy to get everything out. Love it. Then I used up some nail products. This is the Ex Express N um, nail polish remover, where you just stick your finger in and then it's just 30 seconds, then your nail is clean. I have to throw this away because it is so yucky. It has such a very interesting red reddish color, so it is time to go. And then I also used up the Sally Hansen Double Duty Base and Top Coat. I love this stuff. I had I had to love these double effect thingies. I just love it. Then I have a whole bunch load of makeup things that I've cleared out that is too old that I've used up. First of all, the Body Shop Vitamin E Hydrating Face Mist. Love this stuff. It sets my makeup and it also gives my skin moisture, so it's good. And I'm throwing this out. This is the Benefit Their Real Mascara. I love this, but now it's just so completely dry. I need to try it. What is it? They have a waterproof version of it now. So I have to try this in the waterproof version. I can't wait. I love this stuff. It makes my lashes look da on flick. Used up the Brow Drama by Maybelline. It's just in transparent. I love this stuff. Used up some powders. I used up the Maybelline Fit Me powder in number 115 and the NYX Finishing powder, the HD one. 
in transparent. Love it. So good, so good. And I've used up the NYX Day Matte but not Flat Powder Foundation. I oh, talk about double effect. Love this. I am a powder foundation girl. I just rekindled my love for it. So good. Oh, I used up a primer. And this is the Gush Foundation Primer Classic. Not, I'm not a big fan of this anymore. Not after I've tried the NYX HD. Um, Primer, uh, this is just nah, not for me. It has that silicony feel to it. It's just nah, not for me anymore. And I've used up a NYX HD eyeshadow base. Love this stuff. You know I can't live without this. So it's so good. It's so good. Just hold on to it. When I put the uh, my eyeshadow on, it's just they are not going anywhere. Love it. Use the lash glue up. Just a little itty bitty thingy. And I've used a, yeah, I've not used it up, but I, this is dried out. This is a glitter eyeliner by e.l.f. in Stardust. I haven't used this much, so it's just going out. So mascara, this is the Maybelline Last Sensational. My, this is my favorite by Maybelline, and I, it's just, well, divine, love it. And I've used up a, yeah, used up, I can't sharpen it anymore, it is so short. This is the Maybelline eyeliner in the dark brown. This is just, yeah, it is so small. I can't sharpen it anymore, it is too small. And we reached the bottom of the bag, yippee! Now I can finally say we're uh, done with this empties video. Uh, maybe it was a bit fast, but it was a hell of a lot. So, so yeah, I really hope that you enjoyed this whole, not this um, empties video, this empties video, because I thought it was quite long and there were so many things. So anyway, I hope that you enjoyed this video. So remember to subscribe, comment, and like this video if you liked it. It really helps me a lot. And then you can follow me on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and on my blog. And then I will see you in my next video. Take care, guys. Bye.